there's no way we were gonna have a hobby show without the crafty queen herself, April Kalu, everyone. I mean, come on, she produces, she's an expert, she does it all. So we know that your passion, we've talked about your passion on the show before, but you have many passions, you I have do. many hobbies because you have so much time. Mother of two, <laughs> job, side hustle, but there's even more crafts What's you sleep? like to do. That's What's the sleep? question, I don't even sleep. Who needs I it? Really, who needs it? I don't. <laughs> um, crochet is my first love, but everything you see on this table, Tracy, I can do and I have taught myself how to do every single thing on this table. Oh. And I know that that sounds like a lot, but I'm here to tell you that it's not because okay. There are so many all-in-one craft kits out there that you can get. So you can wake up one day and you can just say, I want to start a hobby. Yeah. You can walk into any store, not even just craft stores. There are so many stores in general, like dollar stores yep. everywhere that have these all-in-one craft kits. You don't have to walk in with a list and be like, I need this, I need that, I need this. You just walk in, everything's in the kit for you and you can start your hobby. Which is yeah. great. I think a lot of us learned that during the pandemic, but we might have just ditched them. It's time to pick that stuff back up because it's good for your mental health. It is, and I was gonna say, thanks for mentioning the pandemic because yeah. yarn and thread crafts actually are really good for your brain. They increase mm. dopamine, they reduce stress, yes. they boost your self-esteem because you're accomplishing projects. They also instantly mm -hmm. calm and relax you because of the their part. like meditative, like. Uh, they're very repetitive with what yes. you're doing with your hands. Yes. So they instantly calm you. It's a very addictive feeling. I'm completely addicted to that. I love it. But that's a good feeling to be addicted to. It's so good. Right? It's so good. Okay, so let's start with uh, your first craft yeah. there. So they I combined so um, embroidery and cross-stitch. Okay. So embroidery, they are pretty similar, but embroidery, they have the same embroidery hoop. They use needle. They use thread. You can use, like, a linen material. Um, I actually used a dress that I didn't like anymore, and I oh, used nice. this one. This is my very first, these cacti over here is my very first embroidery ever. You did well. I see a thousand imperfections, but what? that's me because I'm a perfectionist. <laughs> so good. This took me just a couple hours. Hours, but I mean, it's just something you can pick up and do. Yeah. Um, the difference with cross stitch is that the pictures are a little more boxier. Yeah. They're like pixelated, so you can't do like round curves in this like pizza and this avocado that you I see. see. Um, that's really the main difference. Okay. And the material that you use for cross stitch is called Ada or even weave linen. Okay. So that is just like evenly weaved in, uh, material. And if you look a close up at this material here, you'll see all these little boxes for cross stitching yeah. and really how you cross stitch is you're adding an X in every single box to create oh, the picture. That's so why it's a in, cross stitch. In, that's why it's a cross stitch, exactly. So that's really all you do, you're just following the pattern, they tell you where to put the colors. Uh -huh. And before I talk about any other hobbies here, if yeah. you wanna start something today <clears throat> mm -hmm. that is the cheapest and fastest to learn, it's cross stitch. Well, Absolutely. that's what you need. So the Joy cross stitch kit, everyone is gonna get one in the audience. So go start today. Yes, Joy. Choose Joy. Okay, what else? do we got? Is this like, are we going to talk about your love? I had the real to love talk your about life? crochet. Yes, I mm -hmm. want to influence everyone to crochet. So mm -hmm. I follow one of these makers online and she is so lovely. She is Canadian. She's an entrepreneur. Her name is Emily. She's from Quebec. Uh -huh. um, she creates these boxes that can give you all, all the tools that you need to crochet. Love that. So everything you need from yarn to hooks, measuring tape, and then you get access to a members only section on her website where Ooh. she will mentor you, give you patterns, give you video tutorials, all the things yeah. for you to learn how to crochet from the bottom up. That's amazing. It's great. So like you, you get can, support. You get support. Like yeah. you can absolutely just go online and Google how to crochet. Sure. But if you want someone to help you, I think mm -hmm. this is a great way to start just so that you can kind of get used to it. That's beautiful. Like, yeah. I okay, so that. get one of those kits um, mm -hmm. if you're looking to start something. Let's talk about yes. these, I don't know, humongous needles. Humongous, ginormous needles. Nobody bothers me when I take these on the subway, by I the way. I guess not. I'm knitting and everyone's like, no, don't talk to her. Stay away from her. Stay away from her. Okay, so We Are Knitters has a uh, categorized some kits called My First Project Kits. Oh, cool. So if you have zero knitting experience and you want to just knit today, yes. they are perfect because you can learn very easy stitches and easy projects. So okay. this one is a snood, which is like a cowl. Very that's, easy. That's what they call them? And if you want, yeah, snood. If you, a snood. If okay. you want to get a little ambitious, I did this over the weekend. You can totally do it, okay? Only It April. is a cardigan. Only April. Look at this cute cardigan, everybody. That is so good. 
This, if you. anybody knows knit stitches, I don't know if anyone does, but this is the garter stitch, the easiest knit stitch, and it's just five panels, oh, no so shaping, right. and it is a cardigan, and it is a beginner kit. I love that stitch because it looks this, big and beautiful and it? nubby. You can make a blanket a throw. That is so good. So I can't believe easy. she makes a cardigan. <laughs> Like no, on weekend, train right no. in. It's amazing. Okay, next up, do we go to these? Yes. Okay, okay, so let's get the kids, the tweens, the teens, the yes. everybody involved. So you've already mentioned I'm a mom. I have a 10 and an 8-year-old. They're so um, cute. Daughters, and they see their mom crafting constantly. Yeah. So they are really influenced, and they really want to learn all the things. So nice. they, Toys R Us has really amazing kits that you can get that are very crystal clear in instructions. I can... Pass them these kits, and I can just go do laundry or go make a sweater. Oh, nice. Right? Or go do something else that <laughs> yeah. I want to do. Yeah, go make some socks. Yeah. Um, and I can leave them alone, and they can be personalized. They can choose what they want to do. So they have a string art. They have sew animals. Nice. Really cute beginner kits for kids to get them creative and get them off the screens. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. We actually are going to gift the audience string art. So everyone in the audience is going to get these. Give them to your kids or use them for, your, for yourself. The string art kit. Okay, can we talk about this one? This is, like, you love this one. It's very satisfying. I left this one for last okay. because I cannot explain it. If anyone is having a day, you yes. need to get a punch needle kit because you are going to be stabbing and punching this fabric, <laughs> and you are going to love it. Let loose. Punch it and I'm stab screaming. It. It's so amazing. Okay, so this is the final product of this one. It's this beautiful. one's from Michaels. Okay. The one thing I want to say is some of the kits and punch needle I noticed don't have the punch needle in it. Okay. Okay, so just make sure you read the back so it says sold separately. But once you have one punch needle, you don't need a hundred. So you just need one. Right. And they're very, very inexpensive. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna show because I want you to do this. It is okay. so fun. I'm You're literally watch. just puncturing the fabric, uh -huh. pulling it back up, keep it really close to the fabric again, and puncture it again, and just keep going. Okay. Just like that, you're gonna do it right now. It's so satisfying. Tell me how much you love it, go. Okay, I love it so much. Yep. I haven't even done <gasps> one yet. Look how good oh you are. Oh my God, I love it so much. I ruined it. Did I ruin it? <laughs> I want to show something quickly before we go because I know we have to leave. So it, just say you're like, oh, I made a mistake. Oh no, I made oh, a no. mistake. You're going to pull it out. Oh. And you're actually just going to run your finger underneath oh, and it brings easy, the fabric eh? right back to where it was. Oh, that's so good. Yes. Abe, this is This is really good. I think you want to get your hands on this stuff. And of course, if you are looking for any of these items on this table right now, we put a QR code on the screen. You scan it with your phone and then you can shop the show because this is going to ease your mind and that's something we could all use more of. Apes, thank you for that.